iniciamos brillando. Esta nueva temporada, Radio 13 Digital conecta a nuestro espíritu, al amor, a nuestra esencia y energía. Despertemos luz y conciencia. Reconectemos con nuestro interior. Nueva temporada Conectando con tu Luz, Radio 13 Digital, programación consciente. Those issues, but also enjoy what you're seeing here at the Super Bowl. What, what's your opinion on how the NFL has uh, handled the Brian Flores topic? Well, I, I, I believe there's no way you cannot say that there's been some conversations going on upstairs about what Brian Flores has levied against the NFL. The, the, the thing that went on with the Texans just a minute ago. Before they hired Lovett Smith, all, all reports had pointed to that they were going to hire Josh McCown. Got that never coached in the NFL at, at, at all. They were going to give him a, that. That went right to the heart of what Coach Flores had filed. So I figured there's no way they could go in that direction because they would have shut the case right there. So, so they, they, I, I guarantee they, they, they about faced and. And, and made that different decision to go with Love it. So it, it's it's having it has had an immediate effect, but 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 immediate effects don't always last. What can you put in place that's going to make sure you have continued success, not just immediate success or some form of it? What's the best play uh, for you in the history of the National Football League? Oh, that's a hell of a question. I don't know if I can pull out one play to make it the best play in the history of the National Football League, but I can go somewhere and give you this because it's home base for me. There's a play that we have had in the National Football League that has touched every aspect of the world. And that was just a play down the sideline from Roger Starback to Drew Pierce. And they call it the Hail Mary. Everywhere in life, somebody has gone through some hard times, and the last little bit of hope they have, they said, I need a Hail Mary. Yeah. It's football touching the world in ways you never thought. So to me, I'll pull that one play out, the Hail Mary, yeah. because it goes all over the world. In every aspect, people are pulling out Hail Marys. Who's going to win the next Sunday? Why? Well, I'm still working on that. I, 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 I'm still working. I still need to take in information. I can't get have a determining factor on who's going to win without all the information being taken in. And I got a lot of ways to go with that information. So I'll know by 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 by, by Saturday by Saturday evening who will win that game. But I'm gonna say this to you. Whew. I mean, this is your home stadium. I said this last year with Tampa Bay. How do you allow a man to come in here and beat you? How could you? Do you not understand? Every time you look at this stadium, every time you walk back in this stadium to play your games next year, all you gonna see, all you will see is that Cincinnati Bengal color confetti. You playing? You you could be playing somebody else. You could be playing, you know, the Miami Dolphins, and you gonna look up and see Cincinnati Bengal confetti falling. It, 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 it's it's like it's like letting a man come in your house, sit at your table. Eat your damn food while he's holding your wife's hand and drinking your wine. What are you prepared to do about this? That's what I will say when I'm talking about what the Rams will is going to have to be and what the Cincinnati Bengals will will have to match. And what you, the matchup you want to see, the best matchup you want to well, see. Well, it, it is the Jalen Ramsey and Jamar Chase matchups. That, that's the matchup I want to see. Mike, what do you think was the best game? <laughs> What, what do you think was the best game you played, your best performance? Wow. Wow, my best performance. It's, 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 uh, so, so, many, so many parameters go around that. Is it because, of, uh, how do I dub it my best performance because what I did on the field or, or the best performance because the stage that I was playing on, you know what I'm the saying? Well, what, what, what do you place that around? The results of the game. I think one of my greater games, greatest games, was, was the '94 championship game. We lost that game. You know, we, we, we spotted them 21 points and we lost that game. But it was the fight in which we fought with 
the whole team and never giving up and coming back and being that close to turning the game had we got that pass interference call for Dion. That 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 that, 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 that validated for me what I knew to be true when we won the prior two Super Bowls that we had that we had those fighters in that locker room. That even in that moment coming off back to back championships, we fought to the bone for that game. And it's the one game that that hunts me every day. Every day of my life still what, to this day. And what would be the, the best play from yourself that you remember the most you like? The plays I remember the most in my whole career was yeah. that first touchdown in Super Bowl 27. Okay. Anybody, right. any kid that ever played, dreamed of playing wide receiver, dreamed of catching a touchdown in the Super Bowl. And, and, and that Super Bowl 27, that was, that, that yeah, that, that, that eight route, it was an eight route. Just a, a deep slant, bam. That was my that was my most memorable play. Now I came back 18 seconds later and scored on a uh, on a post corner, which was probably my most acrobatic play. Yeah. Two touchdowns in 18 seconds, two offensive touchdowns in 18 seconds, which is a Super Bowl record. Probably the only record I will hold for the rest of my life because now that you know Cooper Cup just broke the record of 100 yard games in a season. You know, 25-year record, he had 13, I had 12, you know, Does he had an extra sting? game. What's that? Does that sting? Does it hurt a little? Yeah, it all stings. You get older, man. Listen, you you know, you just time just fades you out and push you on out of here. You know it just fades you out and push you on. I'm like, hold on, let me hold you know. So, so at least, least I know two offensive touchdowns in 18 seconds in a Super Bowl, I'll never get that one. You ain't going to never get that one.